on number seven. Um, why am I running with the LP? Well, I first ran for off for office in 2001. I was with the LDP. When the LDP broke up prior to the 2004 elections, I went to the only party that I see has a genuine ideology and is composed of people of uh, good stature and integrity. So I went to the LP and I've been with the LP ever since. Um, why am I supporting Noy Noy Aquino? Well, uh, he's the only one who has been through the test of, of power. Among all the presidential candidates, not one of them has been tested um, uh, on how they would handle power when it is in their hands. When I'm referring to the presidential power. And we all know how a presidential son can abuse the power of, a, of, of his parent as a president. Noy Noy has been through that and he has shown humility, he has shown integrity, in spite of being in access <coughs> to such power within this country. So he has already passed it. I don't want to take a gamble with the others. I want the one who has already passed that crucial test. Uh, people are questioning his competence. Well, it's just unfortunate that people are relying on impressions. Because if you have been, able, if you have been given the chance to work with Noy Noy, you will know that he is competent. If you browse through the records of Congress, the transcripts of debates, uh, plenary sessions, committee hearings, you will see his intelligent participation in Congress. He acts as a fiscalizer. They, uh, they, they challenge him with the number of bills that he has filed, but why do, why do we look up at Joker Arroyo with, with high respects? If we look at his track record in filing bills and passing laws, it's also comparable to Noy Noy's. But Joker Arroyo was performing a role that was also uh, within his responsibility as a legislator, and so with Noy Noy. But the difference of Noy Noy with many other politicians is that when he speaks, he does not look for a camera to speak to. He just speaks to the record. He, he doesn't want fanfare, he doesn't want publicity, because he just wants to work. And I've seen, the, seen it firsthand. And in this presidential election. We've been through nine years of an El Nino of uh, integrity. We're now looking for a, a spring of hope, of spring of character, because competence is what will get you up there, but it will be character which will make you stay there. A lot of competent people have gone up, they fell down badly because of character. And as far as Noina is concerned, I've seen that he has character which would um, let him uh, handle power worthy of our trust and confidence. That's why I support my man.